this is Robin Moses and I am painting a floral beautiful tutorial and let me show you my palette. I have got all my orange, light orange and white and then my mustard and light and white and dark and low. But it's, it's white, orange and mustard with white and black mixed to it. Okay, I have used OPI, dun 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 dun, Osaka to me orange. <laughs> and this is not a pure bread. It is a Franken polish. It's mostly Sakatumi orange with a little bit of white added to it. And I have used Dragonfly by Jessie's Girl. And when I am done, where we go? Okay, there we go. I put Dragonfly on this nail. The rest are, uh, is the orange. I did um, some little stems in the in the colors that I showed you and I am ready to start my flower. So I start with a medium <clears throat> to light orange and I'm going like this around in a circle, a little bit lighter. Yeah. Like this and like this. Okay. And I just want to fill this nail up with a bunch of daisies. And it's going to be in the same family as, as the orange color that I painted the other nails, but not exactly, a little bit lighter. And the more you can get in there, the better. And I got the inspiration from a magazine. And of course I've done it a million times. But every time is just a little bit different, so I'll just show you really quick. It's right there. Oi! <laughs> What's going on, sister? Oh, my goodness gracious. Oh! push the go button and then she starts acting a fool every time she didn't do that <laughs> okay so with the, the um with the darker mustard color um, I'm going in to the centers of these <laughs> she got me that was a funny one okay and I'm gonna push in the centers of these little daisies Okay, then with white, I'm going to highlight them. I love this positioning right now. I, I'm staying in frame kind of, and I'm not moving around a lot. And if I laugh, it's not going to take you out of frame. It's <laughs> awesome. There. Okay, then on this one, I'm going to go around the center with little tiny light circles like that and if you can't get this down please girls just practice on paper and boys I have some boy watchers practice on paper and get these strokes down you just push and pull push and pull push and pull and just fill it up and then top coat I mean highlight boom 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 and then you have a little nail full of daisies okay and then on this one I am going to take the same orange that I started the, the flowers with and I am going to just kind of scroll around and add pattern to the rest of the nails without really really overdoing it because when I top coat this it's really going to almost make them um, the same color. It's just barely going to shadow. And that's what I want. Now, the reason I'm doing this nail is because these are really super good for weddings and especially for um, spring weddings and bridesmaids because the, the, the bride can get roses and then the bridesmaids would get the daisies or whatever like and you can do this to where you can do the whole party in different ways but still use the same kind of design to go through. So 
I don't know if you guys remember the ones that I did with the roses and the gothic, but it's almost the same idea. And if you cannot find what you're looking for in my, um, in my playlists, then Google it. Just Google Robin Moses roses and then you'll find the rose tutorial I'm talking about. And if you need to, like, do Google Robin Moses, Gooby Doo, Robin Moses, whatever, and not, it'll pop up. And this is what I've been using. And also, a good one is Pinterest, because Pinterest, it puts the, the picture really big so you can get really great graphics, and then it has the little link to the tutorial. I've been, I've been working on Pinterest like crazy to get the links with the pictures because I really love the way the pictures link up and everything, and you can keep all of the albums so personal and yet so together. I love that, and I, it, I don't have to like try to sell you either. You know, If you like it, you can pin it, and I won't know about it. I love that. So basically, that's what I'm doing, and now I'm going to top coat. So anyways, with the top coat on, you can see now that it doesn't really show up as much, and it really is just an enhancement. It's really just almost like a shadow. Um, I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, so if you try these, please show me at my fan page, Robin Moses fan page at Facebook, and I'm going to pin these, and if I do, please... Um, pan them around and tumble them and everything and I'll be back with more. Everybody have a great night and bye!